Hello, I'm Garnbreak1, and this is Midgardia RPG. Today we'll be playing Mists of Akuma for D&D 5e, which was provided to us kindly by Mike Myler, who is the uh, writer of Mists of Akuma. We will also be using a module called Scourge of the Robot Temple, which, again, was provided for us uh, to us for free by Mike Myler to help promote the upcoming uh, Mists of Akuma Kickstarter, which I think is the Imperial Matchmaker module. Is that right, Carter? Real matchmaker and right. Yes. Trade war is already written. I have both of them going, but. And this is actually the first mod tool of the trade war adventure path. So if you're interested in a nice preview of it, well, you're already here. So, good job. I uh, believe that's all I have. Oh, yeah. Mists of Akuma is a fancy, no, Eastern fantasy noir steampunk setting. Is that the right order of words? I think that's the right order of words. Maybe. Uh, something like that, anyway. Uh, so, why don't you guys introduce yourselves? Um, hi, I'm Hikaru. I am playing Hana, a uh, Tanuki. Hello, I'm Sho. I'm playing Shun, the Kitsune Henge Yokai Ninja. Hi, I am Zayo. I am playing Akari, a Kitsune Henge Yokai, actually twin to Shun, and she is a Juwashu sorcerer. Hi, I'm Pai. I'm playing Zaino, uh, going by Zain, being I'm certain that no one has ever screwed up the pronunciation with anything with an X in it. And they are a Tengu uh, ranger with the sub I guess I was going to say subheading but no, it would be subclass uh, Suku I swear I will get this Tsukugami. Tsukumagami. Ha! Hunter. Hey, that's an X. Is that pronounced Shine? Uh, also, the stream just died. Uh -oh. Interesting. Yeah. Uh, normally, yes, it's just an old OC that I have. Garm. Okay. Uh, oh, looks like we're back. Cool. Cool. That's. It was probably uh, a yeah. That takes a lot of resources. Yeah, please don't do that. It's, it's fine. We're good. Uh, I don't remember what I was gonna say now. All right. Uh, so why are you all traveling together? I know that I'm trying to keep Akari out of trouble. Both um, are twins. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, Akari honestly is kind of a battle and combat focus, so she mostly travels to just find strong opponents. And she keeps Shun around mostly because he is her conscience. Yep. Uh, what about no way. the others are here? What about you, uh, Z? I've already forgotten. Zine? Well, traveling by yourself isn't very interesting, and the more people, the more mm, sparkling personalities. Yes, personalities, not not objects. Of course not. But uh. You you always need more car people to talk to when you travel. Shun, Hana, good luck. All right. So um, I'm traveling with this group because they seem like they need someone to look after. Them. We are perfectly capable of traveling without adult supervision. Thank you. We are adults. I, mean, I was gonna say yeah, we are adults.
Aren't you all like four feet tall? Between four and five. Four foot six, thank you very much. Oh wow, I'm taller than you. <laughs> We're the tallest. Me. Excuse me, I am two feet five <laughs> inches and one half in the morning. Two feet five inches, three centimeters and a bit. Uh one inch is two point five four centimeters. So Congratulations, so, yes. show you are playing the tallest character in this campaign. <laughs> There's a first time for everything, apparently. Alright, so you folks have been traveling throughout the wilderness of uh, Sukochi Prefecture. And as you're walking down the road one day, you realize that there's something following you. And by realize, I mean there's a fox trotting down the road behind you guys. Yeah. Ooh, how many tails? Yeah. How many tails does a fox normally have, show? I was just making sure that it wasn't a hanga yokai. I mean, it might be a young one. It's got one. Mm hmm. It's not Naruto, I promise. Um. How long has it been following us for? Uh, since you woke, since you started traveling that day. Yeah, no, uh, Akari is just gonna stop, turn around, look at the fox, and say, hello. It lets out a, uh, slightly surpri surprised squeak. <laughs> but, uh, doesn't move any closer to you. That was adorable. Uh, I'm going to try and carefully but slowly come towards it for, I'm curious and it's a fox for every step that you take towards it it takes, it takes one, back. one back I think I'm echoing <laughs> <laughs> um, hmm. uh, is anyone else going to do anything Cause yeah I, I would like to try going... well is this an open road or is there like trees and bushes and stuff on the side there's trees and bushes to either side. Okay. Well, while it's focused on her, I'd like to try and sneak through those trees and bushes and get behind it. Give me a stealth check. <laughs> oh, wow. Not very stealth. Wow! Is that the news that would still beat my passive perception? You snap a twig and it bolts off to the side. Yeah. Really? Really, Shun? I thought you were a ninja. You're supposed to be the stealthy one. Well, it's better than killing it, and we needed to get it away from us. Or if it was Maybe it's hungry. Maybe it's hungry. You see a wild animal, and your first thought is I should kill this thing? No, I should chase what? it off without killing it, thank you. What has Car been teaching you? <laughs> Nothing good, evidently. <laughs> Apparently. Look, no one said we've been traveling for long. <laughs> it's true. So right. you've taught him nothing. So it, I mean, he's kind so, of hard-headed. <laughs> so it bolts off into the underbrush after your uh, miserable attempt to sneak up on it. Oh. I'm just going to shrug and walk away. Like, walk back right. to the rest. That's, I'm, um, hmm. I'm going to keep an eye out for it as we continue and see if it reappears. Alright. Yeah, same. When you settle down for food at, at some point, after about 30 minutes of you, you know, catching your breath and eating whatever trail rations you've bought, you've brought, rather, the fox suddenly appears from, uh, from behind a bush nearby with a scroll case held in its mouth. Hmm. Huh. It, it drops the bamboo cylinder at, uh, let's see, Zion's feet before, uh, bolting away. That was odd. Zion, was what the is same that? box, wasn't it? Probably. Sorry? Did it look like the same fox? It was, yes. Yeah. Zion? Zion, what, uh, what's this scroll say? 
Mm. You gonna open it? Maybe. Well, what do I have to tell you this isn't? What? What do I have to tell you this isn't? Speaking because we're all curious, and if you don't exactly, I'll and give if you're really curious, if you will. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> tell her exactly what's on it. Uh, which hand are you using to unclasp the scroll case? Claw, you mean? Which claw? Yeah. Well, we... talon. Talon. Are you my oh. hands? Yes, yeah, your hands. <laughs> It, they do have it? claws at the end of their wings. Yeah, that's their hands. I don't know if you were aware of that. Okay. They don't actually have hands. They have... Which oh. appendage are you using to open the school <laughs> case? Please say mouth. Oh, please say mouth. <laughs> I was going to say, how large is the scroll case? Large after contain a scroll. <laughs> uh, comparatively, is big. this like... You know, a, w would it contain something like a piece of paper, or would it be like a giant poster, is what I'm uh, saying. Piece of paper. It's about the size and shape of a unspecified energy drink can brand. <laughs> oh, right. That's the thing I was going to agree. Thank you. That was what I mean. I forgot about it. Yeah. Just, like, sure. um, left hand. Okay. Yeah, you open it just fine. Uh, inside is a note. It says, and I will drop this in the chat so that uh, if I talk too fast, you're still fine. <clears throat> Greetings! Your reputation's for... Oh, well. That's cool too, I guess. <clears throat> Greetings! Your reputation's proceed to you, and so it is that I must request we meet to discuss matters of some considerable importance. I realize that your time is valuable and that it may inconvenience you, but unfortunately I must insist that in no less than two weeks you arrive at Hanashichu Grove, or sorry, Hanashichu Grove, east of uh, Kiyosakuna, beyond, between dawn and sunset. Punctuality is essential. I look forward to meeting each of you. Signed, Nature Wielder, Yanju Bame. Do we recognize that name at all? Uh, that's a good question. Hold up. <laughs> <laughs> and how far away is this place? Uh, less than a week. Okay. No, I don't believe you recognize that name. Okay. So whose reputation is this person talking about? Totally not mine. Yeah, I was going to say, Hannah, do you recognize this name? Is it your reputation they're talking about? I don't recognize the name, considering their innate... ...what they need. <sighs> well, I mean, we have nothing else planned at this point. Perhaps their nature is to give us things if we help them. I mean, that is true. They'll give us my shiny bead. Them. Here you go. And I just pull out a bead from my bag. What color is it? Um, it is green. Right? It's a, like a jade colored green. <laughs> it is blue and yellow. And into the bag it goes. <laughs> Shall we? Yeah, I guess yes, so. Yes, let's go. Why can't that's we arrive north. at night? I think that's north, because if we're anywhere else in Sukochi, considering Kyosuke is to the north of Sukochi, uh, let's head north. Yeah, sorry, my mistake. I think I screwed up where you're actually supposed to be. I think you're somewhere over here-ish. Oh. So you have to go down into Sukochi. Across Bobby. the mountains. Yes. Oh, there is... Why. There's a pass through the mountains right about here. Okay. So you okay. don't have to... Um, Trek through the hellish wastes. Yeah, I'm, I mean, walking everywhere in the mountains, right? Uh, <laughs> yeah, everything. totally. Yeah, I mean, we'll set out immediately then. I mean, 
Nothing planned, at least. Nope. Take life as it comes, you know? Just oh, chill. I'll just let nature guide me. Maybe nature That's will yield you instead. Wow, what have you been smoking? Yeah. Must be something good. <laughs> Do you have any? Uh, marijuana <laughs> jokes. That's how you know that we're a classy party of adults. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Anyways. <laughs> um, as you cross through the mountains, the winds begin to, to drop in temperature with every passing day. As it is, you know, the start of autumn. It's getting colder outside. The, the, the hot summer is over. The air is no longer filled with an endless choking smoke that leaves the skies orange all the time. Oh, wait, that's real life. Sorry. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's not orange today, luckily. Anyways. Okay. Anyway, uh, the winds of autumn begin to drop in temperature with every passing day. Uh, and after you pass through the mountains, you reach a town called Kiyosokuna. It's it's a, uh, a fairly it's a safe and secure town with a you know large hill on the center, uh, known for its cadre of shape changing samurai. <clears throat> if sorry, uh, where you're heading is shape changing sorry. samurai. Yeah, and that's probably my favorite combination of two words I've heard this week. Yeah, I'm. My hood kind is definitely. What shape up. do they take? Are we talking Henga Yokai or. Uh, I think. Yokai are the only shape changers in this setting. <laughs> no, nope. there's also the Druid Circle of Beasts, which. Uh, is awesome. Yeah, the one you... I was considering. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure, but I think it's that you're not sure exactly in character you just know yeah. that there are there are rumors of uh shape-shifting samurai here hmm. i just yeah, is, do a yeah. side glance it shouldn't <laughs> i pretend not to notice uh you're about four days away from uh hashishu grove hashichu grove at this at this point how are if, we doing on time you're about four days away from Hashichu uh, Grove. Oh, uh, from we the... had two weeks to arrive. How long until the deadline? Uh, oh. We... oh, sorry. Um, about a week. Okay. We'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Well. Let's just... We have to make sure to arrive there during the daytime, apparently. Yep, between dawn and sunset. So if you want to stock up on anything before you continue your journey, or, uh... We all have our traveling supplies. I mean, I, we might stock yeah. on sure, more rations. Food. Yeah. Restock on food and the typical shit. Alright. ask around what people know. Yeah, I'd like to ask around about what place we're going to. Alright, uh... Alright, uh, give me either a persuasion or an investigation check, or... Can Sorry. I help you? Uh, sure. Okay, I'm gonna aid you. Up, okay. not like it. Ah, too bad. You have reduced the universe. Uh, Wait, why'd you do wow. intimidation? Because it's right above... Uh, investigation. Um, I have a zero on both, so five it is. Oh, wait. Eleven. Eleven. Well, no wonder you failed. You tried to be intimidating, and you're nothing but a tiny tanuki. <laughs> <laughs> you're do, fuzzy. Do the female ones also have huge testicles? Uh, they're not We're testicles. Not that Darn, they're not testicles. But no. Okay. They... Actually, they do, but they're not as big. Um, okay. please, can we please continue on with this? They're not. <sighs> <laughs> Alright, uh, well, you do not succeed. Oh, Boru. Oh, That's wait, it nice. says male Tanuki are easily picked up from females. Notable for their sizable Boru. So. <sighs> well, 
because you are so gosh dang small, people just you 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 try to call out to them, but they look around, see nothing, and keep going. Look, I may be three feet tall, but I'm like two feet and a half wide. <laughs> You are very square. Yes, I am. Thank you very much. These limbs taken for a crate. I, I have a portly statue. Okay, well, that didn't go great. Um, hmm. I, I kind of feel like everyone's us. just getting distracted by Akari, who is definitely not aiding me anymore. Um, all right, well, I guess we'll find out when we get there. Stop being so pretty. What? I'm not doing anything. I'm trying to help you. By distracting them? I'm not distracting them. You were flirting oh, with that man. I was what? not flirting with him, thank you very much. Oh, it sure looked like it from down here. I was trying to get information here. from him. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get your borrow in a twist. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> right. I was trying to help, thank you very much. Hurry. <laughs> Keyword here hey. being trying. So you guys just gonna head off on your way and hope for the best then? Yeah. yeah apparently, I mean, uh, Hannah was kind of useless. Not the most charismatic person. I've noticed. Really? So, uh, who's gonna be leading the way through the wilderness? To find the grove. Absolutely not me. Not me. I, uh... Don't we have a ranger? Yeah, Sign, sign Sign's a ranger. Sign, are you, sign, are you any good at survival? Well, I don't want to help. I already did the helping. I got my shiny. Yeah, but we're going to get more shinies if we go and help this person, remember? Yeah. So, so we, we have to, to prove that you're any good. I've Will you at me. least help me? All right, I guess mine's not helping. <laughs> All right, well. Uh, should did you say that out loud? I was trying to, yes. Does does that sway you, Zion? It's no, purple. because I appreciate a good insult, and the best you can come up with is brat, even with a sibling. What? Wow, he's always, he's always been really bad at that. Actually, he he's just not good at insults. Oh wow. The one that called you Brad, Are not you... him. Have, have you even been living? He, he doesn't well, much, actually. Well, I guess boring. you don't want this really shiny purple bead. Fine. All right, I Hannah. I really wish I could blow a raspberry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry? You can Sorry. make the noise of blowing a raspberry. Sorry, mm. I'm going to point out something. If we find this place and we can get lots of shinies, we'll this job will probably also be really fun and we'll get to bother people. Bother? Yes, exactly. Uh -oh. so bother? No bother. No bothering people. Bother. <sighs> so we need to find this location as bother. quickly as possible to bother them. I'm, I'm, I just Kay. got a hand on my forehead. <laughs> just... Can Wait, you lead the way? Bother. Yes. <laughs> All right. All right, Zion. Uh, I'd just like to say that Zion and Realtar would be the single worst pair of uh, party members. Of this <laughs> oh, my <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh yes. To be oh fair, goodness. they're both proficient in nature. Horrifying. <laughs> All right, survival, though, I think, But this right? is a survival check. Yep. Give me a survival check. Got advantage because I'm helping you. Uh, All actually right. no. You oh. would have had to succeed on your previous attempt to get advantage on this. Wait, but doesn't the aid action advantage it? Yeah, does. it's aiding. Well, you're probably right, alright. <laughs> okay. 
Do I still have it on talk to myself? Maybe. Maybe. Yes. Classic okay. birds, am I right? <laughs> I always talk also, to themselves. Of course, once the session with the bird person starts, the birds outside my window shut up. Yes, <laughs> of course. I was actually wondering about that. Yeah, no, window's still open. They just stopped talking <laughs> like an hour ago. Oh my god. Okay, we're doing great. This is a great start, guys. <laughs> guys, we, we, we are so ready for this job. Our reputations are fantastic and we're proving it right now. Mm -hmm. yeah, at least I'm consistent. Yeah, I mean that is true. Oh yeah, this is gonna be fun. All right, uh, just, let, let me let me figure something out real quick here. Uh, okay, buddy. Oh no. Okay, great. That's that's good to know. That's good to know. That is pretty average, I guess. You don't see how badly we were screwed. All right. Uh, why don't you guys talk amongst yourselves for like two minutes while I, uh... <clears throat> Grab a map. You didn't up So... Yeah, I'm getting that now. I thought I had. So, Sime, Sime, how do you want to bother people when we, uh, find them? How about we don't? Incessantly. <laughs> hmm. But like by being really loud or obnoxious or... Neither. Why not? It's fun. That, that just gets you in trouble. It's not recommended. But you get into trouble, then it's really fun getting out of the trouble with a really creative way. Creative and uh, flair. That works. That's I'm how you so get sorry, into guys. trouble, and then people will do bad things to you. You don't want to do that. That just means they strong, they send really yeah. strong people after you, and then you get to fight them and beat them. Besides, that's only true if you get caught. Exactly! <clears throat> that to the rest of my people. Hey, you rest of your people! You only get that if you get caught! <laughs> Sorry, uh, uh, Rule 20 is giving me some issues here. It's yeah, alright. Uh, I'm trying to drag out the stuff for this um for this thing and it's just not doing it so i'm just gonna refresh roll 20 and we'll uh we'll see how it goes hopefully yeah. that fixes it please don't kill each other in the meantime <laughs> we're not gonna kill each other within the first half hour god yeah, yeah that's 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 45 minutes yeah, give us an hour Matt, would you stop he is physically incapable, and you know it. <laughs> yes, so are you secretly yeah. playing your cat hen are you okay? Uh, you- you see Zine look over to their bang of- Shh, shh. <laughs> ooh, ooh, what do you have? What do you have? Nothing. What do you have, oh. though? And you see it, Kari and all three of her tails just wagging excitedly. <laughs> uh, so you see a very, very well-loved cat plushie with- um, one of those metallic pieces of fabric, um, shaped into a coin on the forehead. Ooh. Oh, uh, you recognize this as a stylized version of, a uh, Maneki Neko, or Lucky Cat. Ooh. But with much floppier limbs than you're used to seeing, because instead of being dick dignified it looks like this is something that you would grab by one limb and just sort of drag around so like a child's toy yes okay like Ooh. you could have found this in like a toy box of a five to ten year old human <laughs> but Ooh, you could definitely tell what it what it came from yeah like this was definitely based off of Sign, it's so adorable. <laughs> huh? What? What was that? Stare. What did I... Right. Uh. So, how do you guys feel about spiders? Just out of curiosity. 
That's about right. Kill with fire? <laughs> Cut off all the legs and then destroy the body? Okay, I'll be I'll be nice to you this once you're getting an encounter that isn't spiders, because I like you. Thank you. Or because you're creative and then something else can be scary. Thank you, Tolkien, for making it so that everyone wants to just chuck spiders. Just because one stupid tarantula scared the piss out of you. <laughs> I'm giving you mercy from the from the uh from the table. I almost used the wrong kind of token for this. I almost used a tank with the same name as the thing that you're <laughs> that was wrong. Come on, it'd Fury be fun. Would, Fury would have loved me, but you know. We would have hated you. <laughs> Just fight an entire freaking tank in the middle of uh, uh Why not? It's okay. It's maybe okay, it goes pink. Tank that goes pink. Alright. Um uh, sorry about the delay, my friends. I was trying to drag them out of the uh preset NPCs thing, but the token wasn't registering correctly. So, uh anyway. I will switch you over to the correct scene, and when I do, why don't you guys just uh, deploy yourselves along that top edge there? The top edge? Where the path yeah. is, I'm assuming? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I am not in the front. Forget that. What? Oh my god. Well, I mean, I'm beside Zion looking at their bag so curiously. The only front line. I mean, I can be, but I don't want to be. <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, okay. Connie and yeah. Zion's line were, were up. Failing at leading you guys. Oh, well, here, <laughs> switch still. So that you can be next to sign the bag. Yeah, once you're ready, you guys can uh, copy the token from the token sheet. Oh, there is a token sheet. You are correct. Uh, I will do that from the rest of them. I've already got these set up with, uh, I think, Direwolf. The guy who does all the generic tokens. Direwolf? Devin, it's Devin. Devin. Direwolf is the guy that does Minecraft stuff. Devin Knight, yes. Girl Break One is very good at remembering things. <laughs> All right. Well, um, as you guys enter this area, you hear a loud, deep roar in the distance, uh, kind of like a. Uh... You guys want me to try and imitate an animal sound on stream? Yes, please. Yes. <laughs> That's what you hear in the distance. Aww. Oh no, not the lawnmowers. <laughs> I mean, to be Thank fair, you. when you're two feet tall, lawnmowers are scary. Yeah, they're like they're like the me medieval versions of Roombas, only scarier. They do make lawnmowing Roombas. That's a thing. I'm uh, sorry. Guys, what? Anyways, <laughs> whatever you want. Do we see the source of that roar anywhere? Uh, no. Cool. Somewhere up up ahead, basically. Through this uh this forest here, yeah. Oh great. Anna, lead the way, please. Okay. Sure. Yeah. Hmm. Side of them. Hmm. Uh if you wanna try and figure out what's in the area, you could make a nature check. I'm gonna try that too. Gonna yeah. suck, but <laughs> that's nice. There um... are trees. Oh, oh! I got double digits. All right. Uh, well, Akari, man, there sure are trees. You, <laughs> you got it. There are so many trees. Hey guys, I think that noise is coming from the trees somewhere. <laughs> Okay, um, Garm, I want to do something weird. Uh, I want to... Can, can I finish telling everybody what they found first? Oh, sure. Yeah, I, the rest of you... Oh, yeah. Oh, I thought you were 17 was for nature. I was like, oh man, somebody actually succeeded. Uh, she didn't okay. roll a nature. Yeah, you yes, that's, that's still nature. the initiative check. Why'd you roll an initiative check? She assumed that we would need one. Oh. Uh, alright, well, 
Zine and Shun, uh, you, by the edge of the trees, find a pile of um, black balls of a thick substance with berries in it. What would you like to do? Did it smell good? No. Uh, probably smells Well, awful. there goes my plan. It smells very bad. Yeah, don't. Or, wait, no. Uh, no, actually, it doesn't smell much like anything. It's. I would like to convince them that this is delicious and they should eat it. Great, no, real persuasion. I would like to, I would like to tell hungry. you to go suck it, because nah. -uh. But, but I've totally seen this before. Black it's goop. rare. No. Uh, like, balls of black, uh, slightly sticky stuff with, like, you can see the remnants of berries in it, like they've been cut in half by teeth, maybe. That looks like someone barfed their meal. No, no, no. If this were barf, it would be much, much more liquidy. No, no. This right, is but if anything, that, that just become... reminds me of the mists, which... Well, that seems like a you problem. So? Chewing, you should eat it. It'll nope, be good for you. Gonna. Yeah, ew, no. I'm gonna lead the way, please. Scoot, scoot. We heard the roaring, like, general, all-encompassing... South. Okay. Um, so what I want to do is... Yeah? Um... I want to make... Sound. Oh, make yeah. Minor illusion to make sound of an injured animal. A rabbit. Okay. Uh, do you have to roll for that or anything? The the sound just happens. How convincing that can be, like, yeah, you can roll an intelligence investigation check. Turns that it's an illusion or. Could you have let us hide before you did that? Yeah, well, she's doing that. I'd like to go off over here and hide. Yeah. All right. Just, just let her grab my dice. Then it's the D twenty. That's the D twenty. All right. Okay, alright. So you're making the sound of a uh, a rabbit that's just injured itself somehow, right? Yeah. It, it's either sound or... Im so I'm doing sound, but doing it in a bush, so like, presumably you can't see it because it's in the bush. Okay. Um, my spell save DC is 12, so that would be the DC. Okay. Uh, give me a perception check, Hana. Fine. Can we please start rolling double digits, guys? <laughs> nope. Uh, you think you see some leaves move right about here in the bush, but that's about it. That's the sound I'm making, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> and then you then you hear a. Mm -hmm. <sighs> What's your cat doing? <laughs> He's doing great. All right. Well, um... you should approach it. But I am gonna move, keeping an eye on where I saw the movement. Okay. I'd like to try hiding over this way. And slowly following. Sure. Sure. Why don't you give me a stealth check as you move through these bushes? Wow. Well, you asked if we could roll double digits, please. That was a twenty-seven, not twenty. Yep. You have uh, you have learned from your previous experiences, and you moved quite stealthily, not snapping any twigs or stepping in any piles of scat. Congratulations. Uh, what about Akari and uh, Zine? Um, I'm going to follow Hannah as quietly as possible. 
I'm not going to try and stealth because I'm not that great at it, but I'm going to carefully follow Brianna. I'm go. Wait, which one of them is the clumsiest in terms of moving? Not necessarily moving stealthily, but just moving in general. Us are clumsy. Probably Hana. Hey! No, I was uh, gonna say, then that's probably them if they said that. What is Hana's dex? Mean. Minus 16 as well. And minus 17. <laughs> I'm a monk! I may be short and squat, but I'm a monk. I know how to move. Eesh. Poor little chibi. <laughs> yeah, we're going to a- What in the heck? I was gonna say, we're gonna in imitate walking like Hana, but for some reason, my built- Oh god. You alright? Pie. Sorry, started dying. Oh. That's less than ideal. Please do not complete this task. Please end task. Oh, come on. Control, shift, escape. Um. No, I was going to say that the scores on my sheet never updated. Oh, that's unfortunate. Kind of so I will fix that in All a right. minute. But. Oh. We are just going to not walk normally, but just sort of kind of funny, as if I were shaped like a square instead of a stick with wings. All right. So, so you're you following walking. right behind Hana, then? Yeah. All right. Do you want me to just move you there? Yeah, go. All right. Great. Everybody stop moving. Everybody roll for initiative. Even Hana, who already did that. Missing a one. <laughs> okay, I have a dex of seventeen, and it. But like among other things, everything says I have plus zero. So that's weird. I'm gonna roll initiative, and then you're someone's gonna have to add like three. Yeah, I can do that. Um, have you closed your sheet anytime Twelve. recently? Yes. Huh, I'm going to do it again, trust me. I was going to say, I'm going to actually refresh roll 20, because that might be yeah, it. Yeah, that's probably it. Okay, well. Sending. Uh, Akari, you see the glinting of eyes here. Oh. Hey. And uh, as you look at it, you see the shadow of something... Large and angry. Oh, fantastic. Um, I am going to try this. See if it hits it. And then I'm going to hide. Uh... I'm assuming that's going to hit. Oh, yeah, that's going to hit. Seven cold, and its speed is reduced by ten. Horrifying! All right, you hear a uh, step back a bit. <laughs> you hear a displeased howl. Yeah, be like, hey guys, there's something over there. How would you deal with it? Sure. What would you like to do? All right. Well, I'm hidden currently, so I would actually like to ready an attack for as soon as it comes into range. Okay. Because I don't uh, break stealth yet. <laughs> Yeah. And Zion, you back? Yes, but that didn't fix it. That's unfortunate. We'll have to do our best. Yeah. Uh, what would you like to do? So, do we see anything? Or is it just... A hulking, shadowy shape with bright, glinting eyes. How tall is it? Uh, sorry for the constant door slamming. I don't know if that's coming through my mic. Um, let me double check its height. About a meter and a half. So, like, taller than a 
this. Everything is taller than me. I'm two and a half feet. It is, in fact, taller than all of you, yes. Medium creature or is it a large creature? Large. Oh. <laughs> okay. It's just like this shapeless, shadowy thing. It doesn't have, like... I mean, it's still tail. in the foliage. It does not appear to have yep. a tail. That's why I'm waiting. Yeah, all right. One, two. I'm going to hop up and fly backwards into the foliage and hopefully not run into a tree. All right. <laughs> Hana, all of your friends have abandoned you. What would you like to do? Put a hand to my temple. Um... So you said it was... Yeah. Right. Um, I'm gonna move forward. There to force it to come closer, but I'm not gonna get any that. And instead, um... I'm going to open my palm. I'm going to out of my and then I'm going to throw it at this shadowy creature. All right. The 19 hit. A 19 hits. It takes two fire damage. Okay. And as the bolt of fire hits it, you see brown fur on it. All right, come out. We know That's you're there. Turn? Yeah. All right. Stand there with my quarter staff. Yep, I've got an eye ready. You see the shadowy figure uh, shake itself off, and you hear the distinct of "fotum, fotum, fotum" as it runs towards you, towards you out of the bush. Come on, oh, switch. Really the... Wait, you had to take it? Oh, right, yeah. And no. show, I believe you had a... Uh... Yep, I had prepared an attack for as soon as it came in range. Uh, since I'm taking the attack action, I can actually throw three kunai. Horrifying, so... okay. Well, one. <laughs> okay. Oh, I have, I'd say I have advantage, but I don't think I need it for that a, one. A natural 20 does... A, a 23 also hits. A 20 <laughs> also hits. You sure okay. you programmed your attacks right? Oh, we're right. sure. Yeah. Okay. S and then I again. get sneak attacks since I was hidden. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Are you fucking serious that you did not expect this? <laughs> Surprise, he's the DPS of the party. Oh, wait, ignore the second one. Oh, okay. Okay. All right, well, it's dead. <laughs> <laughs> It takes like three steps out of the bush and then just gets <laughs> impaled <laughs> to death with kunai. <laughs> Nothing personnel, bear. Impressive. Does the does the bear look like it's been uh blessed by the mists or anything? Give me a nature check. Breaking Are we out of initiative? Yes. Okay, then I'd 20. like to retreat Does a twenty work? Yeah, it's a normal bear. <laughs> okay. Looks a little hungry, but that's about it. Well, it looks a little dead. I mean, yes, thank you. It looks it looks like it's dis looks like it's disinclined to fighting against you further. Uh, yeah. Thank Thank you, Grandmaster. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Well, that was just a bear. Dramatic. Yeah. Are you guys always this cowardly? I fight <laughs> from the shadows. I, I am in the shadows. Oh. Right. That's why you have me around. All right. Well, yes. let's keep going. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Keep moving yourselves through the. Uh... The forest of fun. And doom! Hana leading the way. 
Yes, because all of you squishies need someone to hide behind. Also, that was bear scat, by the way. You found a pile of bear scat. Oh, yes, scat I know. Earlier. Yeah, that's what I figured. Yeah. By the way, you just hear from the underbrush. Doom! <laughs> <laughs> Oh man. Yeah, actually, I'm gonna stay and brush myself. Yes, follow the doom. You can hear the sound of burbling water ahead. Bridge. Are there any trolls waiting to. I was trying to think of like a really bad troll catchphrase to say, but I can't think of anything, so I'm going with no. <laughs> well, I'm gonna say good luck to the two who are dooming back there because um oh, I'm out of the, the brush as soon as I realize that we'd have to cross water. <laughs> oh you can try walking through the water instead of the bridge to avoid any ambushes. Yeah, no thanks. No, we're just gonna keep our eyes open. We are uh, yes, we are. Just look You're at right. the perfectly normal and safe bridge. Perfectly I'd like to look at that bridge, bridge and make sure that it's a perfectly normal and safe bridge. And it's not it's trapped or anything. Perfectly normal and safe bridge. I would like to fly and over stop the river. There. Yep. That's exactly what I was like. I'd like to... You see eyes peering out, peering out at you from uh, over here. Where? Where? We can't see your ping. You're on the, uh, D I'm on the DM layer. <laughs> ah. Sorry, friends. Clock button. I'm trying to roll initiative for me again. Look. Hey, look. Hey, listen. <laughs> Never. I am missing one of you. Yeah, we're missing... Uh, what? what? I'm attempting to fix my sheet. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah? And I'm still talking to myself because I was just being just... 11.17. Alright. Yep, we saw it. It went on the turn orders. It did. Hmm. I was still thing. talking to myself. That's strange. Okay. It is, but well... Either way, it was fixed. Because <laughs> I just remade the sheet really quickly. Oh man, scary noise to the scared and he actually goes first. Alright. Uh, would you stop? You see a black and orange striped beast in the... trees. A black and orange striped beast of fantastical origins. <gasps> Are we going to fight <laughs> lions too? We already had the bears, and there's the tigers. It's charging at the tiny square one. <laughs> Does uh, it look like a sugar cube? Yes. Uh, it's gonna bite you. Oh, wait, no. It's rotation. Sorry. Sorry, I'm just double checking. It's... Right, you're getting clawed. That's what's gonna happen. Okay, cool. Does a does, an eight, does a does a twelve hit you? No. Shoot. I sidestep it. Well, Akari, it's your turn. Okay. And I <laughs> wrong case. I was wondering if that was gonna happen. This is a nine hit. <laughs> Uh, nine does not hit. Okay. And that ends my turn. Alright. I'm not getting Doon. close to that thing. What would you like to do? Uh, I'd like to get where I can get a shot at it without being a, uh, my buddy over here. And then I'd like to huck a couple kunai at it. Alright. How many of so, those do you have? Uh, I picked them up, but I have six. Fourteen? Uh, fourteen one. does hit. 16 for the second one. 16 also hits. 9 9 hit. misses. Correcto. Okay. So 5, 5, and then I get sneak attack because I have a friendo in the way. So 
So terrific. Sixteen. Sixteen damage. All right. You impale it several times with kunai. The other one probably ends up in a tree somewhere. Aww. Hana, there's a tiger. All right. I'm going to teach like? this kitty some manners. Good luck whack with it. that. I'm going to whack it um, on the head. First. <laughs> Are you? <laughs> Are you You're really? Going, this is what happens when you try to use a quarter staff with one hand. Yeah, why is um, you? Because, you miss. Because it's only finesse if it's one-handed. Um... Mm. Also, because I get an unarmored attack as a bonus action, um, so since the quarterstaff missed, I'm going to try an unarmed strike with the 11. And you're going to miss. <sighs> you threw yourself off because you expect to hit with that uh, yeah. first strike. Yeah, that's... Yeah. yeah. Oh, well. Zyde! What would you like to bird? Squat. I really expected it to be dead, honestly. <laughs> I hit twice, thank you. That's nice. My fly speed of maybe it didn't notice me. Um, can I see over the sides of this bridge, uh, or do we have to go around? Two feet tall. Man, Two if and you a half feet tall, thank you very much. If you weren't incredibly short, the answer would be yes. Unfortunately, you're incredibly short, so the answer is no. <laughs> if you want to, like, fly and dive bomb it, I'll let that go, but... Okay, fair. In the meantime, kukulaku, kukulaku. <laughs> what about perching on the... On... Yep, that would, that would work. Bird. <laughs> Do you want to perch like some kind of pigeon? Doom. <laughs> oh god, I'm gonna have to run. All right. Which is... I appreciate that this week you've been playing the two extremes of Edge Lord. <laughs> uh, does running give me disadvantage on attacking, or is it just for AC. advantage on attacking me? Wait, uh, we're playing fifth edition, so you yes, cannot... thank you, which is why I'm asking. The way it works is you dash. Dash takes your action. All right then. Hang you on. see a tiger and suspect it doesn't like you. Well, fine then. I'm still screaming doom at it and uh, mm. blowing raspberries at it because I can't see anything. <laughs> so you're blowing raspberries near it. Well, I'm blowing raspberries near where the sugar cube, I mean, uh, Hana used to be. <laughs> I realized I spelled scaring wrong. It should definitely be. Yeah, I and I, and, yeah. I, I thought you had done that. No, I got confused midway through typing it because I had to fix something. <laughs> <laughs> Good All right. job. That's your turn, Shine. Shiny. <laughs> All right. Uh, you're getting bit by a tiger. Uh, Hana. Does that a sixteen hits. hit you? No, 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 no. Seven piercing damage. As you feel tiger teeth uh, embed themselves in your fat. Akari, what would you like to do? You mean fluff. Uh-huh. Yeah. Hey, at, least they didn't bite you. at least they didn't bite you in the board. <laughs> Let's try this again. It had to be very tiny. Oh! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> nat 20. A nat 20 does, in fact, hit. She is That's my 11 damage. Alright, uh, it is... Very weak and probably realizing that it's made a bad decision today. But it's not dead. What? Attacking th four? I mean, we're tiny. Thought it could take we're all we are tiny. So Sorry. tiny. Yeah, I'd like tiny. to scoop behind it and instead of Kunai, I'm going to take out my katana because Ronan. All right. And I have advantage for this, right? Because flanking? Yes. Just pull your katana out of your turn stroke, and uh, a 17 hits. Cool, for 7, and then sneak attack on top of that, another 6. Okay, would you like to say a cool one-liner as you kill it? Um, nah. Don't want to waste my breath. 
Okay, so you're gonna stand there silently as it gets like sliced in two by your dramatic, you know, teleport. I will flick attack. the blood dramatically off of my katana and sheep it. Red. Wait, I can see this. I'm gonna make a shink noise as he runs through it. <laughs> he's not doing it right. <laughs> and then I'm gonna get my kunai back. Oh, all right. That's I love you, Pi. It is now one of the times. I think that was God's I love you, not sometimes I love you. Oh, all right, fine then. Yes, it was God's. I speak fluent Zio. It's okay. So, yes. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Uh, you guys successfully make your way through the rest of the forest without encountering any spiders whatsoever. Thank you. That was what the tiger encounter replaced. Uh... You were supposed to fight three giant spiders. Thank no. you, powerful and gracious DM of the <laughs> only four-legged encounters. <laughs> yeah, you guys are so good right. at fighting school to us. And... Thank you, not very power or merciful DM of some other campaign. <laughs> That's not this one. I will make it my entire purpose in that game to make your life a pain in the butt. That's what players do. Yes, I normally do that by accident. Now we're just <laughs> going to make an effort to do so. Oh, Carr, poor you. Bye-bye, All Carr. Right. All right, anyway. <laughs> so, as you guys make your way through the uh, the wilderness of Sukochi, you find a very large bridge which, you, which uh, is necessary to cross. The uh, Kosatsu Bridge. It's a 600-foot-long suspension bridge made of rope and wooden planks, and the only reliable way to access the difficult-to-reach valley nestled between the base of the vast eastern mountain range, where the meeting place awaits. <clears throat> the wind seems to pick up, and you are struck by the feeling that something is awry as an ancient rope bridge comes into view ahead, the only means to cover a span of hundreds of feet below without fighting a raging river below. Far below. Uh... You can see the structure sway from the tumultuous air currents, and looking onward to the woods on the other side, it seems as though the shadows of its trees are just a touch darker than they should be. And then a vehicle revs far in the distance. <laughs> uh, what would you like to do? What time of day is it? Uh, it's probably starting to get dark. I suggest we make camp on Okay. And how many days do we have until we need to be at the grove at this point? About three more, I think. You're. We're you got good. three. Yeah, you're still good. Uh, staying this night shouldn't completely okay. screw you up. All right. I don't like the looks side, <laughs> and I do not. Enough. I will look for a likely spot to camp on this side of the bridge. Cool. So, who's taking watch tonight? I mean, we will take turns. Yep, um, I can take one. I'm going to point out right now, guys, my uh, perception is a minus one. <laughs> yeah, I, I can take one. <laughs> I was gonna say I can, I can, can't see so great in the dark. Who else? Right. So I, mean, I can smell it. June takes the first watch. Akarians. Yep. Okay. Hello. All right. Oh, night passes on eventually. Awesome. Uh. All right. So is the next morning still windy and ominous? Yeah. I mean, it's the top of a valley. It's kind of inevitably going to be like that. Yeah. All right. Cool. Well, now we have like sunshine. I'm. Yeah. Orange. And red sun. No, it's a uh, it's a nice sunny day over here. All right. Cool. All right. So let's uh let's get crossing the bridge. Uh -huh. Yep. All right. Hana, lead the way. 
I will leave. So it's Hana in front. Is it left wolf and right wolf in the center and then bird in the back? Wolf? Excuse me? <laughs> you piece of fucking shit. How dare you? <laughs> Fox one and Fox two, thank you. He's a shit. <laughs> you hear wolf noises from the back. Wolf whistling? No, that's, that's, that's cat, cat whistling. calling. That's cat calling. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, Zan's just gonna follow the kitsune going, ow. <laughs> <laughs> really? Alright, I'm gonna assume that I'm basically right then. All right. Yeah. So, uh, when you're about halfway across, <clears throat> while you cross over the bridge, dark clouds swirl in the sky, in spite of the fact that I just said it was sunny out. Shit. <laughs> time to uh, know, time to, uh, you know how the weather uh, magic, is. Magic it's, bullshit. It's a 600 foot bridge. It's really long, okay? Uh, and humanoid shapes emerge from the woods in front of you. Looking behind you, you realize you have been flanked as more appear on the other side. The forms leap and sprint on the flanks of wood, jittering and shuddering with maniacal laughter from, as from each side, the monstrous only advance, weapons drawn. Lovely. You see, you see a half dozen abedo oni hunch, hunchlings and one abedo oni ninja uh, approach from each side of the bridge. So that's a total of 14. That's the same amount from each side. Wait, 14 so, from each side? No, 14. Team total seven oh, from each okay. side. Ugh. Okay. Good news is you're in the middle of a 600 foot bridge. So it's going to take them a while to get to us. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to start sprinting forward. Ah. Um, I'm going to start sniping them from far away because I have a spell that has 120 feet reach. All right. Yes, but I will recommend... follow you until I can start casting magic. I'll All right, follow as well. Can I out? So, uh, are you guys gonna take long range pot shots or anything? Or um, I will. What, just... what is the long range of a longbow? I think it's one hundred and twenty. No, it's more than no, that. No, sorry, three six. Yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say the the regular range is like two hundred. Longbow. Um, Garm. Yes, my friend. I will say as we start running, I cast Mage Armor on myself. Okay. Six hundred. One hundred and fifty for the first increment. Six hundred for the. Second. Okay. So you could Come literally uh, shoot from one end of the bridge to the other. See. I totally want to try this. So you should. If this works, it's gonna be so bitchin'. So you should be able to get four shots off if I'm doing my math right before they get to you. If you're, um, uh, if they, if I'm full walk dashing. Walk one fifty. I'm full dashing. My movement speed per turn is. Wow. Yeah. Monks. Mm. That's messed up. Um. So yeah, it's not gonna take me very long to get to them. Um, as I'm approaching, because I don't have any long but as I'm approaching, I will, um, I'll probably set off a frostbite. Okay. Yeah, 60 feet. So when I'm 60 feet, so one turn before I get to them, I'll send off a frostbite to the closest one to me. Okay. Uh, Zion, you want to give me three range attacks? Uh, Garn? Would yes, I still friend. have time to get one firebolt off after the mage armor? Should be able to, yeah. Okay. I'll let Zion do their attacks first. Alright. Uh oh. Oh. Ho -ho. <laughs> nice. Oh, we really like those Nat 20s. I'm not Apparently. complaining. I'm not either, because I think we'll need them. So your first shot planks one of the small ones in the head and knocks it so hard it hits another one and both of them stumble off the edge. Nice. The second shot clips one in the leg and it tumbles between two of the slats and falls to its death leg as it falls. Uh, the third shot unfortunately misses. That Fireball. was your warning shot! 
I don't think that's how it works. <laughs> well, it didn't warn the other two. Three. I mean, you're right, yeah. This I'm one, running. I am, I am a kind and merciful shiny god. Oh, uh, sorry, I'm actually wrong. The last one does hit. <laughs> so that oh, would never mind. So I could be kind and merciful, but you know, uh, but instead, that <laughs> firebolt. That's is that a is that damage or no? Yeah, that's to hit. It's the attack that's rolls. The hit. No. That hits. Really? What? That uh, hits one of the tiny ones. Oh, Eight please copy correctly. Please roll twenty. I, please, I beg you. No. Okay. Uh, so that was sorry. one, two, four of them died on that side. All right. Are they uh, all tiny? Five. Did you say? There is a very. There's a taller ninja-looking one. All right. I'm gonna aim for that one. Okay. Sorry, I was trying to. Oop. Oop. So how many did we kill before they got to us? How much did we thin the herd? Nice. Yeah. Hey, look, Hannah. Yeah, I'm gonna oh, go wow. for the ninja one. Okay. Uh, sorry, it's gonna be one brief uh, second. It's a constitution uh, saving throw, Karu. It's a saving throw. No, no, no. Throw it's... Oh. If it hits, they need to make. Ah, uh, gotcha. Uh, that does not hit. It doesn't hit. They don't need to make. <laughs> All right, cool. All right, uh, give me an issue of rolls, my friends. Aha, I go before you, Ninja. Uh, Hey, Garm. Also, yes, comrade. Uh, which of the ones did you use? Because I had to remake the sheet. So I, I think that might have been the, error. the. Yeah, I think that might be the one for your boy error. Hold on. Listen, it was it. quicker to remake it. All right. You briefly hallucinate a second bird. <laughs> <laughs> I would also say these guys are probably like at least forty feet behind me because I've been running faster than them. These are the guys in front of you. Oh, no, no, the, no, no. the rest of I mean, my us. companions. Okay, right. I mean, I've been dashing, so I've been doing 60, so yes. I probably was. Right. And I've been doing 80. Yes. Both Dash, the dogs yeah, go back I, there. I do 50. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, Karu. I'm only that much behind you. Yeah. All right. All right. Friends are way behind. Not going to get hit. Friends. Yeah. Mm. Friendship is great. I love friendship. Uh, all right, Zion, you're the first one up. In front of you, there is a very small amount of enemies. Behind you, there are several more closing in on you, but you've probably got, like, three turns till they get to you. What would you like to do? Caw. Yeah. I was going to say, and is it caw? <laughs> <laughs> that is just a mere fraction of what I will do. <laughs> Oh god, the shortest one is the fastest one. The square one is the fastest. Do you roll like a Goron? Is that what's happening? <laughs> no. Yes. yes. No. No. Cannon. Wait, more important question. Do you bounce on the board? I, I don't nuclear... establish this. My Boru are not big. Room. Also, I have a quarter staff, so I could imagine myself vaulting forward. So you're I'm a, a pole monk. Vaulter. You're a pole vaulter then? That's pretty dope, actually. <laughs> I'm um, gonna point out we're on a bridge with huge empty area between slats. She's really that, good. That's at why it. shit. Yeah. The the monk part is, is that more of a pogo stick into the into the river. The real question is, how can something so poorly aerodynamically designed move at any sort of speed? Because <laughs> <laughs> monk, that's why. Well, that's what the hat's for. She tilts her head forward and it just uh -huh. like I makes her a, a perfect aerodynamic shape. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but that's still a fat hat. <laughs> and like vaulting on a bridge like this is easy enough. It's uh you know, this is all natural wood, not the fancy modern stuff that we have. So like a furry at Anthrocon, you just gotta aim for the knot and you're good. Yeah. 
Anyway, continuing uh, which on, one what these, you like <clears throat> Which one of ah. these things looks more menacing? Definitely the big one. Uh, How big is the small one? Small. It's hunched over and weird looking. Yeah, your size. Define Just weird like, looking. Uh, it's hunched over and here. Let, let me drag its token bigger. Wow. Beginning. This one looks menacing. This thing's weird. And doesn't it look like, like it has puppet. any shinies on it whatsoever, which means it's it like useless to me. Oh man. It almost looks like a bolt. <laughs> they plucked. They plucked on. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> it, it has a beak. You know, I may have used up all of my skill aiming with my first three shots. <laughs> Gee, I hope it doesn't go errantly to the right and hit anything that's super, super aerodynamic that would be in my way. Like the ropes of the bridge? Oh my god, I will watch. Yes, like that! We're on the bridge! Somebody can fly. Uh, you're aiming at the tiny one? Okay, that hits. It has taken an arrow to its knee, and is quite wounded. No, that tradition wasn't actually in effect at the time. I asked the historical time period of the mists of Akuma. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Where you all we remember have, that, uh, right? <laughs> we have the robot Roomba lawnmowers, because if there are mechanical creatures, then they're totally mechanical uh, tools. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Well, some of those steam eggs are probably tools. Exactly! I'm not kidding! We have Roomba lawnmowers! Right. Okay. I'm good. Okay, uh, Akari, it's your turn. Okay, one, two. I'm gonna try this once on uh, the more menacing guy. Okay. All right. 20, sorry. Uh, 20... Two hit. Oh gosh, sorry. Uh, a 20 does hit, yes. Okay. And this is going to be lightning damage. You're doing a fairly significant amount of damage, and let's just all ignore that you can see their health bars. I'm sorry. I was going to say, why can I see their health bars? Yeah. Like, I'd love I can't to see my with... allies' health bars. Yeah, I was going to say, I'd love to see my allies' health bars, but... And then I'm it's just off the day, screw you. Uh, and that'll end my turn right there. Alright, Shun, what would you like to do? Well, I would like to move a little closer. And then I would like to hold my attack until he comes closer to me. Okay. Until any of them come closer to me, really, but you know. And that's it. Okay. I almost called out for a battle ninja B to start their turn. Um, okay. Well, the hunchling is going to move closer to you and do whatever trigger whatever attack you have prepared. I'm betting it's kunai. It is. Shoot, Act I'm kunai. good at this. <laughs> What'd you get? 16. That hits. 5 damage. It is very nearly dead. Well, I've got two more of them. You terrify me, sir. That one's already taken Done. 10 damage. Nope, that did not hit. 10. I'm guessing anyway. Uh, 10 does not hit. Yeah, that's what I figured, and I've got one more. If it rolls. We can dream. Ah, 14. 14 hits. 5 damage. Blur. Cool. That's it. That's the noise things make. Alright, uh... Ruler button, ruler button. Where is the ruler button? 
It's the circle with the ruler underneath the magnifying glass. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, they changed the icon for it. I see. Yeah, so you can change whether others can see what wow. you're measuring. Wow. All right. Good to know. Good to know. No doubt. No doubt. Legit. All right, Shun, you are obviously the biggest threat here. Smile. Uh, you are going to get stabbed. Does a 24 hit you? Yes, it does. What was that, by the way? Uh, that was a ninjato. Ooh. Ninjato, sorry. Magical slashing damage. Four of cool, it. so that was four. Neat. Yep, and you're getting stabbed again. Does a 17 hit you? Yep, that does. All right. That is going to be four more magical slashing damage. I want the shiny. Also, I want to stab this thing. Please let me stab. <laughs> uh, also, Akari, smash. there are things behind you. And since you're at the back of the party, you are going to get attacked with a shuriken. Does an 18 hit you? You're uh, muted. I know. There you go. Uh, excuse me, Joe is muted. That hits, but I am going to use shield. So that makes yes. my 13. All right. 21 AC now. Okay. All right, I am just going to push you all towards the further edge of the bridge so I can actually bring the guys on there. I thought uh, they were three rounds away. Yeah, that's actually pretty surprising. You're right, that's true. Whoops, ignore everything that just happened. You're <laughs> right, you still have two more rounds. I'm good Yeah, I was going to say, I would have started shooting at them already if I had that short amount of time. Sorry. Never mind, now that happened. I'm Darn Break 1, excellent DM. Uh... <laughs> All right, who Han Hanamori, you're up. What would you like to do? Uh, I'm gonna move behind this guy. I'm gonna try and flank him. Um, advantage and whack him with my. Good luck. Yay. Uh, that does... Sorry, I just realized I scrolled too far down. Yes, that does hit. Cool. That's going to be six bludgeoning damage. All right. Then I'm going to jab with my other hand for 22. 22 also hits. Uh, that's another six damage. So 12. All right, so that's 12. He is severely injured. Awesome. All right, are you going to make like a crow and steal a kill? Or are you going to worry about the things that are coming up behind I mean, us? Why would I do that? I'm not the one in the back. Yeah, you are. No. <laughs> the they're car is for the back. Us. Yeah. For the back. Oh, yeah. Uh, also known our... as a right fox. Oh, no, no, that one's dead, so there's only... Hee hee hee! I'm going to assume I was in that square because I was in between two. Yeah. You're a bird. You're quite flitty. Oh, I hope you're tackling him off the side. <laughs> Just like in my footballs. My football I anyway. don't know how to respond to that. Just like in my football anime pie. Uh, I still don't know how to respond to that. Uh. Poorly. Well, yeah, you respond by missing, apparently. <laughs> and. Ew. Why don't you give me a damage roll for that, buddy? Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, I would love to. <laughs> oh, crap. You do some serious damage while the rope's on the bridge. Knew it! Oh. It's fraying. It hasn't quite ripped. But the side is in danger. Oh, man, I'm so glad I can fly. <laughs> Akari, I'd like to point that out. Yep. Uh, Akari, they're two turns away. What would you like to do? Um, don't I, dare, this? sister dear. 
Okay, I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm shooting this one. Yes. 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 <laughs> if you miss and it gets the bridge, I I'm take... going to point out one of my arms wraps around the side of the bridge I'm on right now. <laughs> right. I like you. <laughs> Come on, right box. You miss. Okay. But you don't hit the ropes. Okay. Oh, Thank God. <laughs> I'm so disappointed in you. <laughs> hey, I'm trying, and I'm going to take one more step forward and end my turn. Okay. Do you still have your arm wrapped around the rope? Uh, considering shit, yes. I'm ready that... to grab on. Okay. Ready to grab on, but not actually. All right. Yeah. All right, left fox, what do you want to do? I want to stab this thing. All right. With a katana. Katana? So why does it... Katana. Okay, it reset my katana's, uh... Reset buttons. to a katana? Katana. It to strength when it's not. <laughs> that was weird, roll 20. Stop that. 21 to hit. A 21 hits? 6, and then, just in case, sneak attack as well. So 10 total damage. And he is slain. Cool. So, you have two turns until the enemies yeah. appear? I would like would to. You, would you like to just reposition yourselves and skip to? When yeah, well, I, I would like to actually get my kunai back if I could yeah, sure. and reposition myself. Yeah. Uh, you said we had two turns. Mm hmm. Um. Ready to keep running. The, okay, get my kunai. Run. Um, if, we if might want to actually. Their speed is about ours or less, we can outrun them to the other side of the bridge. Hmm, this is true. And I can bonus action dash. You are, you are not faster than that. Wait, no. Hana is, no one else is. <laughs> I, I can bonus action dash, so I can take the dash yeah, action Yeah, so twice. can they. Yeah. No, I can take the dash action twice. Oh, right. Oh. Bonus action, then action. Okay, yeah. so, uh, so what you, you gonna do? you can leave your sister behind. I mean, yep. she was. She almost did steal my kill. Wow. Anyway, let's just reposition ourselves and maybe, maybe At somebody least, wants to I tie mean, the rope. Or if anybody has that. mending. Fuck that shit, running. We're running. Um, we'll run so that we're closer to the other side of the bridge, basically, even though they're going to catch up. Okay. I will hang back so I will not go at full speed just so that I'm in the back. Okay. Um, but we'll, we're basically moving towards the other side of the bridge. Yeah. And get to the end of the bridge and then turn around to face them? Yeah, basically. Okay. Sure. Alright. Uh, Should position we reposition? Ourselves, yeah, over at that right edge there. Okay. Akari moves halfway into the void. Hang on a second. Why How is tall it... are the ropes? I don't know. There we go. Like, uh, between the slats and the ropes. You could jump up to cut Why them. Is it... Which I think is what you're really asking me. Hey, Akari. Mm -hmm. Uh, I, th I think you should maybe we go closer to the north. Okay. Hana, uh, Hana do you float? Let's avoid, let's avoid cutting the bridge down, please. Do you float? Just answer the question. Get. Yes. Okay, then. <laughs> if we survive no. the drop. It is a pretty far drop. We don't yeah. die, remember? I'm Would gonna you... regret saying this, but I'm reciting the turn order to the top. <laughs> For simplicity. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna regret that, Garm. Please, oh, I yes, you are. Too. Wait a second. I'm on the edge of the bridge. I just stepped off the bridge. Yep. Wait, are we at the edge of the bridge? Like, yep. back? Yeah. Okay, then I'm going to step off the bridge too. Fuck that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, All did right. we actually reach the edge of the bridge? I thought we weren't going to make it. I mean, because we can keep them you at the fastest. Distance. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We were dashing. We weren't attacking for uh, half of nope. our turn, so it was basically double moving. I mean, so, so are they, is the thing. Yeah. They move faster than you. Okay, yeah, that's so a good point. Probably got 
you've probably got effectively another if you spent a full turn dashing you would make it to the end is what i'm gonna say here when they catch up okay guys i don't trust uh zion that much so i am going to continue running until i'm off the bridge same hey he was my favorite oh i know that's why i'm not stopping you i just i want to get off the bridge first yes yes i like you you guys can do that on your turns Zion. what would you like to do I'm going to hop up onto the rope. This is probably about where it frayed that one time where I kind of almost, we're not going to talk about that. And uh, I just have a very ornate dagger. Halt or everybody go swimming. <laughs> they do not halt. Yep. Give us time to really? get off the bridge. Please. Really? All right. Hey, floaty sugar cube. Sugar doesn't float. Well, she told me she floated. Okay. It's thousands of feet below us. The drop will kill me. Oh my god. Hey, you're you're fast All right, the then. I will hold my action until the fat sugar cube will get to the <laughs> other side of the bridge. All right. Akari, dashing forever? Yep. Yeah. Great. I'm moving off to the side here. She Two. fell off the bridge. Yes. Also dashing, dashing forever. forever. Okay. Uh-huh. All right. Two foxes off the bridge. Hana. <laughs> Yeah, I'm Okay. Uh, the enemies are not in the turn order, apparently. So I'm just gonna. You're gonna get shuriken, uh, mm-hmm. Zion, as you wait for. As you nobly sacrifice yourself by waiting for your friends to not die. Does a 16 hit you? It does. You take four magical piercing damage. Keep that thing. Alright, uh, and if you want to start the cutting, it's your turn. This dickweed. Alright. What kind of action is it to switch weapons? I want to say bonus. Mm -hmm. I think it is, but okay. Alrighty. Screw you, then. Switching weapons, we're going to hopefully cut this thing faster. You slice through one rope. There's one more on that side. I thought we already did that one. No, oh, yeah, no. we ran away. Fraying. Yeah. Well, can I shoot the rope? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna call out to Zion to uh, watch their feathers, and I'm gonna try fire bolting the rope. <laughs> <laughs> what is it with the crits today? Just me fucking uh, spray my desk with energy drink. <laughs> well, that's a natural twenty. Yeah, that hits. <laughs> you see the bridge suddenly flip to the side, probably making Zyd, uh make a horrible squawking noise. <laughs> Did they all fall? They do. Yes. It's this horrible squawk half Ooh. between surprise and laughter. This is the greatest <laughs> thing ever. <laughs> oh god, we are the worst and the best. Well, it's more Zion and uh, Kari are the worst. Yeah. Right, and how exactly are we getting back? There's half a rope left. Yeah. Anybody have mending? No. Well, that's unfortunate. I wait for Zine to come back and then I'm just, screw it, I don't care what setting this is. She's just like, high five! That was awesome! Yep. (laughs) You two are crazy. Only a little. Crazy accurate! Uh We got rid of Uh all of them at once! You couldn't even do that. So, what would you guys like to do? Preen. I'd like to mourn the loss of magical shuriken. Wait, is it think that thing still stuck in my plumage? Probably yes. It's another shiny. You're into body mods now. <laughs> Clearly. 
Well, at least your sister appreciates good talent. And I'm just going to uh, play with the magical shuriken I have. Right. Um. So, did, were there any symbols on those guys that we recognized? What? Uh, they were a better oni, basically wandering demons of the mists of Akuma. Okay. They're like a natural disaster, like the noise from Sinful Gear. Okay. Uh, yeah. Sorry, Carter, you were saying something? Can you fire a shuriken into that? Um. I have kunai, and I have six of them. Why don't you ask somebody with a longbow? Into what? Longbow? Because arrows can break. You're... Are you going to pay for it if uh, if I can't retrieve it? I can replace it. Okay, you know what? This if is you can hit too it. Long. I'm going over to the shadow. <laughs> Boy. All right. Smirk. That was easy. What shadow? Yeah, what's that? Forest. I'm gonna call um, out. Show yourself. Like, you hear hands on nothing. hips. Want me to burn it? Hey. No, oh, it's probably gone. Someone Giant. was watching. Want us. me to freeze it? I can watching electrocute us. it. Gone. Oh. Hey, uh, Kurt, give me an investigation roll while you're up there. Uh, I don't have advantage, so that's a two. Boy, this sure is a forest. Yep, it's a forest. What you doing? I just saw something while you guys were talking, but it's gone now. Wait, you what saw something? What, what did, did you see? see? It was like an orange-faced person with a sashimono with a fearsome dragon on it. Huh? Is there a Tsukogami? Tsukumogami nearby? What? No. The... I mean, I did see a metallic glint, but I didn't get a good look at it besides that. And then it just moved, and it was gone. Yes, thank you. Thank you, PDF. That's definitely what I wanted to do when <laughs> I selected that text. That's pretty common, honestly. Uh -huh. Yeah. Um, you do Can not I... detect a Sukomo gummy nearby. Uh, also, for those who aren't aware, a sashimono is the like flags on the banners on the backs of uh, samurai. The like uh, flags. Uh, yes. Yeah. Do I recognize what that sashimono she described? Did, like, what kind of maybe clan that was from? Fearsome dragon in Soberin is unfortunately not all that helpful. <laughs> Pretty fucking common. Um, wait. <laughs> yeah. Sashimono, fearsome dragon. I'm going to fly up 15 feet and call loudly. It can't be that fearsome of a dragon if they are cowardly and run away. <laughs> oh, I like you. Alright, uh, give me an intimidation roll. Come on, please. I'm sorry, I'm two and a half feet and you want me to do an intimidation roll? Yes. <laughs> Okay, then. That's two and a half feet of terror. <laughs> For those of you listening and not watching, that was a 20. Not, not 20, but 20. Do you think you see... Being in forest, there's always some amount of movement in the trees. And do you think you see a piece of it suddenly stop for a moment before continuing on? He went that way! <laughs> yeah, can we try and... It's moving it? at a pace you can't hope to catch, unfortunately. Really? Not even uh, the sugar cube? Not even the sugar cube. Huh. Can huh. we try to see, like, what direction it went and everything? Is it going in the direction we were we were supposed to be heading to get to this place, or...? Oh, goodness, I hope Not so. quite. Probably about 45 degrees off from that. That was probably whoever sent those uh, ninjas after us on the bridge. Apparently. We might want to keep an eye out, but we should probably head in the direction we're meant to be heading. 
Um, okay. Can I look at the bushes where Hannah had seen stuff and see yeah, if sure. I can just see any footprints? Give me an investigation check. Oh, I'm going to try and help her. You're going to help me? Yep. All right. You 17. see... You see something like the uh, the distinctive, you know those uh, the the wooden sandals that Samurai wore with the, the like gata. two wood blocks. Yeah, oh. the gata. Uh, you see that, but far deeper. Like the footprints are far deeper than normal. Huh. As so if something incredibly heavy. heavy. Yeah, was wearing them. Hmm. Something really fat was here. Fat and probably ugly as hell. <laughs> oh well, it's sober, and so you know. We're the only cute right. and fluffy things. <laughs> and it's just about 8 p.m., so I think now is a good time for a break. Cool. Yes! We will be right back, everyone!
And I'm still a break one. I feel like I have another clause of the sentence, and that is a problem I routinely have. So, uh, where we left off, you guys had just cut the bridge and killed several dubiously sentient creatures in doing so, and also ruined a valuable piece of infrastructure. It was fun. Oh. <laughs> Welcome to Morality with McDermott. Hey, what's your guys' alignments, by the way? Um, Chaotic neutral. Good, what she good. Said. No doubt. Yeah. Okay. Awful good. Oh, dear. <laughs> Oh dear, I am so sorry. So you're so telling sorry. me the sugar cube is going to try and convince the flying party member to fix the bridge? Yes. <laughs> I'm not. I think it was great. What is your show? I fed you. Shut up. Okay, so we'll, so we'll be doing a charity stream for repair the bridge. Is that what's going to happen? <laughs> <laughs> All right, bridge aid twenty. Bridge Aid 2018 coming to coming soon to Midgardia. No, no, no. We're not crowdfunding this bridge. It's the uh, hey, come over, look at this bridge, and I'll push you in if you don't give us the money. Good, like a dunk tape. Yeah. Uh, of very bridge. fancy one, very large. <laughs> I'm so glad you guys are my players. <laughs> I cannot <laughs> understand. All right. <laughs> Good job, Kill. Uh, uh, I feel like now is a good time to mention that if you want to support the things that we do and the very stupid things that we say, you can back us on Patreon at patreon.com slash mcgardia or subscribe on Twitch, which will get us $250. Uh, if you have Amazon Prime and connect your account to your Twitch account, you get one free subscription every month, which gets us $250. still get $250. Yeah! Which, and most of that goes towards either feeding Karu, or buying Karu tea, or buying us more tabletop games. All of which are vital to the success of Midgardia, honestly. Mm -hmm. Especially the tea. The tea is important. Yes. I would like to also point out, this is definitely the only thing that I play a little shitlord in. Everything <laughs> else I am... Hey, hey, everything else I am way taller of a shitlord. <laughs> That's valid. I mean, right. you also play an edgelord now. Alright, back to it, I think. Yes. So, a few miles after the Kosatsu Bridge, the trail, which, it's it's a lovely trail. It's a very nice walk in the woods through bamboo thatches, Jezo spruces, and Akamatsu trees. It leads directly to the Hashichu Grove. Uh, the less greenery of the bamboo and trees of the forest grow sparser to reveal a beautiful meadow. The Sukochi Bengoshi has chosen a truly picturesque place to meet. Uh, the nature wielder herself is swimming on jets and waves of water that carry her up from the stream, moving with all the playfulness and fluidity of a playful dolphin. Uh, suddenly, the water swirls into a conical tower that vaults her over the stream to touch lightly onto the ground, and she bows, ever so slightly. I have been expecting you. Thank you for making the journey, though I must say, there is no lovelier bit of sober in than this grove, and the sight of it is worth, get worth the effort of getting here. What would you guys like I, to do? I bow more than she bowed. Thank you for inviting us. How do you bow? You're cute. Do you like I don't think anyone stomach? notices because it doesn't change shape. <laughs> <laughs> you see like the your hat, hat moves a little. The, the hat, yeah. yeah, the hat gives it away. That's the point of the hat. <laughs> <laughs> the only way you can tell where the head's facing. That's good. That's just good UI design right there. Uh, <laughs> what about the rest of you? Uh, I'm also going to bow, but I'm leaving it to the mouth of the party, apparently. Uh, I, I, I think you should rephrase okay, that. Hana. Okay, there you go. The one who stayed I'm, you're Hana letting Hana talk. For us. Yeah, I'm just saying, Hana is not the mouth of the party. And, uh, <laughs> well, I mean, if you we're gonna to give speak it a up, I wouldn't stop you. Half bow, half curtsy as I flick wrists out, which uh, fan the feathers even further. While bowing. Awesome. I, I bow my head a little bit. Just a little more than she bowed, just so I don't get any shit. Also, I think we can all agree, Hana is the mouth of the party, but uh, ZNA is the beak of the party. <laughs> no comment. She smiles at all of you and... Comment. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 
Shocker. Don't kill the DM, please. <laughs> That's her job. <clears throat> there is great trouble in, in the town of Shibai, and we are prepared to reward you handsomely if you are able to deal with it. All of the monks in the temple above the town have either been found dead or disappeared. Monsters have been reported in the area. There is an oni that runs through the town to spread blood and violence before disappearing, like the wind. Hmm. Uh, Do you have a description of this oni? Unfortunately, nearly everybody who has fought this beast has died, with the exception of a pair of famous uh, warriors that were hired by the mayor, the Mubo brothers. Unfortunately, while they have survived against the beast, they are heretics and too incompetent to finally deal with whatever this issue is. They're nothing more than brutes with firearms. They have a description of what they fought? Unfortunately, the only report that we received back from them is very big. They are not the most articulate. Everything's bigger than us. Well, did you have any uh, reports of anything around the bridge causing trouble? We had not heard anything. Why, has something happened to the bridge? There yeah, were yeah. a by an... group of ninjas that it, uh... Two groups of ninjas, in fact. And oh, one coward ran us. away. Something well, is... with a uh, fearsome dragon banner. Hmm, interesting. Is the bridge all right? Did they did those those fiends destroy it? They damaged it. Hmm. Yes, and then then they were seen riding off right after the bridge was destroyed. Most unfortunate. All right, but that is a that is a small issue compared to the troubles of uh, Shibai. Furthermore, <laughs> divinations revealed that another force may be at play in the unfolding drama of the area, though we are not sure exactly what something appears to be meddling. Perhaps that is what we saw. Perhaps. Well, it does seem like they wanted to stop us from arriving, but we Our... made it. You cut oh, off for a second, Peru. Oh, um, it does seem like they wanted to stop us from arriving, but we made it, nonetheless. And we'll put a stop to whatever is happening. I would not like to see more monks killed. I certainly hope you are able to, for should the Robai Shita Temple become truly abandoned, the people of Sukochi would suffer a terrible blow to their morale. And the entire cell of Shibai will be deserted before long if this keeps up. We'll reward you kindly for your service. Uh, how <clears throat> we can reward you with? Sorry, yes, Lord Sukochi is prepared to reward each of you with travel papers to the prefecture of your choice, as well as a hundred imperial pieces. Is this acceptable to you? A hundred pieces each, or total? Uh -huh. Each. Okay. I'm fine with that. I'm sure my companions would understand if we took 20 less each to help repair the bridge. You can take 20 off of yours, sure. I'm not gonna Yeah, don't it. speak for us, please. Who said we were companions? It is noble of you to want to repair the destroyed bridge. And I would, of course, be happy to help fly a rope from one end to the other, but I'm I'm sorry, I would still need to pay for things like more ammunition to fight off these conniving evil mm. creatures. Only very small creatures. <laughs> I'm just gonna pointedly look at Akari and sign and be like, well, as long as you helped repair the bridge that was nearly broken entirely because of our presence. Akari just gives this tiny, tiny smile. If I had eyelashes, they would be a batten. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, actually... Well, then they on fleek. <laughs> yeah, alright. 
Um, I should also probably drag you back to the other screen. Whoops. But doop, you get a map. Uh, it's the sound that things make when they happen, okay? Okay. Is it now? <laughs> yes. No, no, other, no other sound has ever happened. Um, Bored. 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 <laughs> Bored. Well, the rebuilding of the bridge is important for it. It's the only way to reach this area, but there are more prudent more uh yes, more prudent tasks at hand. You must hurry to help the people of Robai uh Robai Shita. In the direction of Robai Shita. In the direction of uh is it not on the map? She by. No. You're right. Um, it's about a day's travel away from the grove after you cross the bridge. You have a map. I assume you're given a map. Is, is it an accurate map? map? Uh, so we're going towards the temple, basically, that uh, where the monks have. I'm assuming the monks that haven't died at the are they still at the temple? They've disappeared. All disappeared. Oh, good. Um. um wow. <laughs> uh, um. Question. Looking at the map, yeah. does it look like uh, that village is in the direction of whatever ran away from us? Yes. Like, would it have come? Okay. Uh oh. Yeah. All right. Well, we crossed the bridge at like dawn because we waited for night uh so i'm assuming we still have quite a bit of daylight i'd like to at no. least rest enough so that we can maybe bandage what some of us got yes we can take all right and then onwards and she yeah uh bids you a good day and assures that as long as you remain within the grove you will not be the prey of the beasts of the nearby woods or mountains Though if you should save more than one night, if the beasts roaming the territory do not uh, do not kill you, she will herself. I like her. She's very honest. Yep. Short and rest the... and then head out. Yep. Short rest for the short party. All right. <laughs> uh, how are you guys getting back across the bridge, by the way? Uh, you said that it was on the same side. Yeah, you? I thought it was on this side. Did I? I no. said. From the wording, That's the wording kind of. Sorry, no, you have to cross the bridge. Oh. Gonna spend two hit dice. Oh, don't... damn it. Well. Uh, you could try and shimmy across the the ropes if you want, because there is still the ropes from one side. I mean, or we could add the one who can fly, fly a rope across. That is, in fact, what I suggested, instead yeah. of giving 20 for my share of it. Yeah. How exactly is... Because... So, what did... Oh. We had to cut the bottom rope, the one holding the... wood planks together. For it to fall entirely, we would need to cut three of the four ropes. Instead, it was just... Um, womp womp. Now it's swinging from the one side, I think. Yep. Yep. I mean, so all guys... of the wood is still attached together. Yep. It's just nothing's holding it in the horizontal position, so all the boards are going vertically. Yep. Okay. Um. Unless you have well, a better idea. I have good news for you guys. And that news is that we're going to end the session here tonight, so you have two weeks to figure out how you're going to get across that bridge that you destroyed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah like, That's I'm very confused. I'm not we very good on... at descriptions. We you're right, on... no. It was not the same direction. My mistake. Okay. Descriptions are hard. I am very bad at words. Okay, so we need I'd to like to point off. out, uh, if you're counting on me to fix the entire bridge, I have a strength score of eight. 
We just yeah. needed to take a rope across. I mean, I it's six hundred feet across. Do you have six hundred feet of rope? No, but the rope no. was just no. frayed, so we just have to repair, like, grab the two ends and basically retie it. Or yeah. even take a shorter length of rope and tie it to both ends, because yep. that'll probably take less work. They're only yep. approximately 300 feet down. It'd be easy. No, I mean, I can tie a rope to one end, tie a rope to the other end, and it'll be fine. We'll figure it out. We're fine. Yeah. There's plans. Oh, you guys are, are so fun. fun. You're going to die because you cut the bridge. That's what's going to happen. You're going to die. <laughs> we you're, were going you're... across the bridge to a mission. Nothing in that mission said we had to go across the bridge the other way. That's I think true. that was false advertisement, and she should assist us on getting across the bridge. That's true. I like how she said, oh, it's no problem with the bridge, except yeah. now you're, you're stuck yeah. here. Yeah. yeah. No problem for her. <laughs> you're going to well, face the bridge if you know what's You're going to have to make it your problem. All right, well, that's where we're ending it for today. Cool. Uh, our next session of this will be in two weeks, which is August the 31st. And next week, next week we have uh, Legend of Hyrule on Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Le Legend of Hyrule and then Wanderers on the 24th. And I would just like to say thank you to Mike Myler for this. You, If you like this adventure so far, you can actually find it on the Roll20 Marketplace. Everything statted out. Just plug and play. And uh, he's also working on some fun Kickstarter stuff that uh, you can see now. Stream. I was going to say, stream. Could yeah. someone put the link if they haven't already? There's no Kickstarter link yet, but... Uh, um, eh. Yeah, it starts in early September, right? Ah. Yeah. 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 This right, is yeah. just advertisement, I guess. Yep. Hey, no one watches TV. <laughs> wow. All right. Thank you for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good night.